Hello, this is Stampy, and welcome to a Minecraft Let's Play video, and the 200th episode inside of Stampy's lovely world. That is right, ladies and gentlemen, I have done 200 episodes inside of Stampy's lovely world, and of course I am going to be joined today by the one person who has been with me for the majority of those episodes, that is Elfily. And of course, we're going to begin the episode as we always do in almost every single one of those episodes by having my breakfast and today we are eating a cake. <gasps> Nom 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 nom. There we go. The, the special 200th episode cake there. And I've got dressed up for this special occasion. You ready to see what I look like? I have been dressed up in my special Stampy Cat party hat, which I only wear on the utmost most special occasions. And actually, I've just had an idea. My Christmas present from Santa. He got me some some diamond boots. Let's take off my my Stampy style boots and let's put on my my special boots that Stampy gave. Uh, not Stampy. Uh, that Santa gave me as well. So there we go. I'm wearing my, my party hat and my special diamond boots. And uh, I do have a... Oh, hello, Lee. <laughs> You're very close to the camera there. I do have a very special video planned, but we're going to begin as we have been for the last few episodes. And that is by trying to throw one of Esther's eggs uh, to try and hit the, uh, the, the paintings. And we're on the final one. There's only one left for us to get. And I can see there Lee getting ready. Is he going to do it? Yep, he's going to go and start spinning in a circle like he always does. And what was that, Lee? <laughs> I think you sent it off to sea. You didn't try and hit the painting right. I've got one egg on me. Seeing as it's the 200th special, I really want to be able to hit it this time. If I throw it to about there... Yes! First go! <laughs> you can tell this is a special episode. Well done me. Woo! And let's just throw... Oh, I've got loads of eggs. Where did all of these eggs come from? I just got a bunch of eggs on me. Where did they come from? Oh, well. It doesn't matter. Let's go and head off. we got a, a pretty busy video today. It's probably going to be a little bit shorter than my normal videos, but it doesn't matter because it's going to be even more fun than most of my normal videos. I'm not going to be building. I'm not going to be playing any games. I am going to be soaring across my lovely world in the sky in the uh, the hot air balloon I built in my last episode and I'm going to be doing that with the soundtrack uh, from a song that was made by this man Francis J uh, he's the person who I'm adding to my love garden and you may remember that a while ago I posted a video uh, where I set a challenge uh, in my sing for stampy song contest uh, where I wanted you to send songs and the winner was going to be having their song played in the background of this video and Francis was the winner but I was completely overwhelmed by the amount of responses we got. We got over 10,000 entries to the Sing for Stampy competition and there were some amazing songs and loads of amazing videos as well that people did and there were so many great entries. I'm going to make sure uh, that I do do something with all of the, the other runners up uh, that weren't actually able to be added to the Love Garden because I do appreciate uh, all of the, the time and effort that everybody put into their songs but Francis uh, I thought had one of the best ones and it was also long enough to be used in the video and so from Francis uh, from South Africa he's 15 years old I wanted to say thank you so much for your song and welcome to my love garden and he was actually supposed to join me in the video uh, but he sadly doesn't have uh, Minecraft on the Xbox, so he wasn't able to. So hopefully I'm going to play with him on PC. But before uh, I head to my hot air balloon, I did want to head over here for a little bit. And I'm sure some of you know where this is, uh, but others won't. This is my first ever shelter. This is where I spent my first ever night in Minecraft all of those years ago. And it's kind of fitting that I spent my first night in here, and then I ended up building my entire house right opposite. So at the beginning of every video, uh, I'm always going and looking back uh, to where I started and I have done so many things in my lovely world leading up to now I have as I said spent my first night in this cave I've built my house to sleep in I've tamed so many dogs and of course mittens as well to keep me company I've dug deep down into the bottom of the world and I've built high up into the sky and built such a massive variety of big and small things. I've put on shows in my theatre and in my circus. I've sailed a boat and a submarine. I've rode my rocket to the moon and met lunar friends. I've travelled back in time in my time machine. I've cloned myself as well as cloning a lot of my friends and uh, a cake as well. I've visited other dimensions and battled evil foes. I've built my fun land full of rides and games. I've eaten hundreds of cakes and killed hundreds of googlies. I've wished, I've dreamt, I've made mistakes and had amazing successes. I've encountered lifelong enemies and made lifelong friends. And I've done all of that with you. 
From the very beginning of my lovely world and my first ever time playing Minecraft, I have been recording and I've brought you along on my journey of discovery, fun and adventure. And that journey hasn't ended. In fact, I dare to say it's hardly even begun. My lovely world will soon be moving to a new platform full of new features, new people and new possibilities. I have had so many new ideas for things that I can do in my lovely world. So as long as I'm still having fun doing it and you're enjoying watching it, my lovely world will continue and grow and still be the stage for even more stories. My lovely world has come to represent my personality and to be a monument of some of the best times I've had in my life. And it all started right here. Right here in this cave, the place where I spent my first ever night in Minecraft. And now, from the for the first time ever, we're going to be seeing this lovely world from the sky. I am now going to go and uh, head over to my hot air balloon and we're going to sell over the entire world. Oh no! <laughs> I think one of the one of the eggs hatched. Yes, yeah, so I'm now going to be flying over the entire world and so you're going to see my house, all of my town, my fun land and all of the yet undiscovered landscape of my uh, lovely world for the first time uh, from up above and uh, keep an eye out for some of the, the landscape because I'm sure uh, it's all places where I'm going to be building uh, in the future. So here we go, this is the, the hot air balloon that I built in my last video. Uh, all I need to do is go and hop up in here. I need to say my very last goodbye to Elfa Lee. Goodbye Lee, thank you for all of your help and I'll see you soon. Bye. Bye. And then I just need to go up to the front here and now we can go and fly over my lovely world. Oh, actually, there's one thing that I need to, to do first. Uh, I need to add my coal up here just so I can get the, the fire burning. So that should go and uh, start heating up. Then if I stand up the front here, hopefully we're going to begin to rise. And here we go. We're flying over my lovely world. seem to be in sequence a spot reserved for those who think they need it inside a world so lovely it feels real a bunch of mini games for us to play with we try 
try to enter Berlin to the racer, but we only seem to make it to the basement. We're having fun, so that makes sure that we will see it through. The only thing I'm missing here is you. With us together, there's so much we could do. Never blue, so come enjoy the view in my lovely world. In my lovely world. In my lovely world. The skies are always blue. In my lovely. Lovely world. In my lovely world. In my lovely world. 